The MG ZST with more tech, more safety with 360 degree camera and more peace of mind from 25490 drive away. The award winning MG ZST. It's the more you've been looking for. Online and on your smart speaker. Homescape tiles just down the range. Salvador Drive, Smithfield. Hit News Briefing. Hi there, it's Amanda Milo with the latest. New Zealand Labor MP Chris Hipkins will replace Jacinda Ardern as Prime Minister as he is the only nominee for the party's leadership. Hipkins was first elected to Parliament in 2008, appointed Minister for COVID in 2020. Massey University's Associate Professor Grant Duncan says it comes as no surprise. He was the first sort of go-to name, I think, that many people, including myself, thought of after Jacinda Ardern made her announcement about her resignation. Wholesale electricity costs have fallen since the price cap was brought in last month. They've gone down 44% in Queensland, 38% in New South Wales since the federal government set a max price for coal used to generate power. While it's welcome news, users aren't likely to feel the relief until next year. Rugby union star Curtly Beale has been refused bail. A 28-year-old woman claims Beale followed her into a Sydney pub bathroom and sexually assaulted her last month with CCTV supporting the allegation. Meantime, Rugby Australia has suspended the 33-year-old from all forms of the sport pending the legal proceedings. And Aussie Athletic star Peter Bowl is now waiting for his B sample to be tested after failing an out-of-competition drugs test. The Olympian has taken to social media to strongly deny any wrongdoing and says he's requested his secondary sample be tested next month. Athletics Australia has provisionally suspended Bowl after a banned substance was detected in his A sample. Get in early for the Williams Back to School Sale. Get 20% off big brands like Colorado, Clarks and Harrison for big savings and a massive range of school shoes. Walk this way to Williams. Plenty of stars are out on court on day six of the Australian Open, including our last two local hopes in the singles, Alex Dimonor and Alexi Popran, who are both fighting for a spot in the fourth round. Novak Djokovic and Andy Murray are also scheduled to play tonight. Our Aussie women's cricket sides aiming for a clean sweep against Pakistan with victory in today's third one day at North Sydney Oval. And it is a big match in Sydney Derby tonight at the SCB. Cloudy and 31 degrees in Mariba today. Overnight temperatures falling between 19 and 23 degrees tonight. Want more local news? Get free breaking news about our community. Download the listener app, search for your area and add to your favourites now.